Watch Sarah Huckabee just unloaded on Hillary in press conference, media stunned. Hillary Clinton's 2016 election perspectives as seen in excerpts from her upcoming memoir, What Happened, have been highly controversial, sparking outrage from Republicans as well as from her own party. White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders was particularly critical of Clinton's attacks on prominent political figures. As reported by the Washington Free Beacon, Huckabee Sanders called Clinton's writings sad and accused the former Democrat presidential candidate of propping up book sales with false and reckless attacks. The press secretary's remarks were in response to a journalist's question about whether President Trump will read Clinton's book and what he thinks of the excerpts that have been released to the media so far. Huckabee Sanders suggested that Trump knows better than Clinton what happened and why the Republican outsider won the election against a well-known candidate backed by the mainstream media and the corporate elite. Whether or not he's going to read Hillary Clinton's book, I am not sure, but I would think that he's pretty well versed on what happened, and I think it's pretty clear to all America, said the press secretary. She continued calling out Clinton for reckless mm -hmm. attacks against the individuals who allegedly contributed to the former Secretary of State's stunning election loss. For Huckabee Sanders, Clinton's critical words were penned with the purpose of being sensationalist in order to drive sales. I think it's sad that after Hillary Clinton ran one of the most negative campaigns in history and lost, the last chapter of her public life is going to be now defined by propping up book sales with false and uh, reckless attacks. Clinton names a number of individuals and events as factors contributing to her loss. As NBC News reports, Clinton blames former FBI Director James Comey for reopening the investigation into her private email server a mere two weeks before the election. According to Fox News, Clinton accused primary opponent Bernie Sanders of causing lasting damage to her com campaign by impugning her character. Clinton writes, because we agreed on so much, Bernie couldn't make an argument against me in this area on policy, so he had to resort to innuendo and impugning my character. Some of his supporters, the so-called Bernie brothers, took to harassing my supporters online. It got ugly and more than a little sexist. I mean, is this unreal? Huckabee Sanders called Clinton's writing sad. Will you buy Hillary's new book? Clinton closed her remarks about Sanders by writing, I am proud to be a Democrat and I wish Bernie were too. Additionally, Clinton took aim at former President Barack Obama for allegedly instructing her to refrain from attacking Bernie Sanders too severely and for failing to investigate supposed Russian interference in the election. Other individuals Clinton specifically names as contributing to her loss include Russian President Vladimir Putin, WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange, and even former Vice President Joe Biden. As the Daily Caller notes, Clinton's controversial anecdotes have prompted criticism from her own party with one of her former fundraisers, calling for her to go away. As covered by Christian News Alerts, Clinton maintains she will remain involved in politics but will not seek elected office again. Really? Yeah, wait till the witch she'll be out there again. Let's take a listen to Huckabee. Also, uh, will the president be reading Hillary Clinton's book? And what does he think about the that have gotten out so far? Uh, whether or not he's going to read Hillary Clinton's book, I am not sure, but I would think that uh, he's pretty well versed on what happened and I think it's pretty clear to all of America. Um, I think it's sad that after Hillary Clinton ran one of the most negative campaigns in history and lost and the last chapter of her public life is going to be now defined by propping up book sales with false and reckless attacks uh, and I think that that's a sad way for her to continue this work. That's direct and to the point, direct and to the point, wow, cold or sad.
I'm sure Hillary is loving this. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.